In this example, a tech startup ByteHive is raising $6 million from a VC firm called SkyVC in its Series A financing. Their existing founder holds 1 million shares of the company. The exit value in 5 years is $600 million. SkyVC has a target ROI of 20 times. Calculate the post-money valuation of ByteHive. The post-money valuation is equals to the exit value divided by the ROI. The exit value is for $600 million and the ROI is 20 times. So $600 million divided by 20 would be equals to $30 million. The post-money valuation represents the value of Byte Hive after the funding is raised. Next, calculate the pre-money valuation of Byte Hive. The pre-money valuation is equals to the post-money valuation minus the new equity investment. So that will be equals to $30 million minus $6 million, which is $24 million. In other words, before the $6 million investment, Byte Hive would be worth $24 million. Next, calculate SkyVC's fractional ownership. How much would SkyVC own in terms of their equity stake in the company? The fractional ownership will be equal to the new equity investment divided by the post-money valuation. In other words, for SkyVC, they would invest $6 million in a company that is worth $30 million post-money. And that would be equal to 20%. In other words, when SkyVC participates in the Series A financing, they would get a 20% stake in ByteHive. Next, calculate the price per share paid by SkyVC for its investment. So what we'll do is for to get the price per share, we'll take the pre-money valuation divided by the pre-money number of shares. Now, before the investment of $6 million, the startup ByteHive would be worth $24 million. And before uh, SkyVC came into the picture, the existing founder holds 1 million shares of the company. So $24 million for 1 million shares would be $24 per share. So that would be the price per share paid by SkyVC for its investment. Finally, calculate the number of shares that SkyVC will receive on its investment of $6 million. So remember the price per share is $24 per share and SkyVC invested $6 million. So if you take $6 million divide by $24 per share, that would be equal to 250,000 shares. So for SkyVC, they would be issued 250,000 shares. The founder would have 1 million shares. Of course, the founder in this case would be diluted. Previously, they held 100% of the company. If you take 1 million shares, divide by 1.25 million shares, which is the total shares uh, post money, then uh, these 1 million shares would be 80% of the total number of shares. So remember, SkyVC would own 20% of the shares of, of ByteHive, so the founder would own 80%.